guys welcome back on this new video tutorial my name is Ulrich and today I'm gonna show you how to fix the screen resolution of your Linux distribution on a 49 inch monitor but this same technique can work on this on other different screen resolution depending on what you're using if in case it doesn't fit so let's jump into it firstly what you're gonna do is open your terminal and you're going to write the following code I'm going to write below if you have a 49 inch, but if you don't, you're going to use the exact screen resolution your screen have. But I'll leave in the description down below the different screen resolution you can see. I mean, that basically exists as far as uh, ultra wide monitors are concerned. So let's jump into it. So write CVT. 3840 that will be the screen resolution I'm going to be using all right by uh, 1080 all right press enter so as you can see right here I have this resolution and this refresh rate normally they always say 60 Hertz refresh rate but as you can see right here it is definitely not all right so I don't really know what all of this means but <laughs> Don't worry about that. That's not our concern for now. To the if but if in case you want to make more research on it, you can still as you will say Google it. So when you type that, you're gonna write sudo xdr xrendr. Um, when you type that, you type new. Uh, it's add mode. No, it's new mode. So you're actually adding a new resolution to your laptop because your your laptop doesn't actually support your uh, a 49 inch. Not your 49 inch here. It doesn't support a 49 inch, and you're trying to add a new mode, a new screen resolution to your laptop for it to actually fit or adapt to the ultra wide screen. So let's keep on doing. As you can see right here, there's an autocomplete which. I will take it because basically what you have to do when after typing this you just copy from here copy all this code from here oh my bad you copy from here right up to here when you copy that it should give you this Copy that. Let me do it right now. Oh, hold on a sec. Copy that. I had to make a lot of research to actually fix this issue because I, I, I've been seeing a lot, of, a lot of comments on some documentation, but I couldn't actually find which one could work as I try all of the solutions, but, but none of them actually work. So I'll paste this and click on enter as you can see nothing really happened but actually something happened and i'll show you at the end of the video pretty much close to the end of the video all right when that's done what you're gonna do is sudo sorry sudo x r a n z r all right add mode all right we are adding this mode all right depending on what port your laptop is connected to your desktop oh, oh my bad <laughs> depending on what your laptop is connected to your display all right the port is either hdmi or i mean the name you attributed to your hdmi because you can actually change the name of either hdmi or edp but as far as mine is concerned mine is edp yours may be connected to either hdmi 1 or hdmi 2 it varies so if in case you encounter the same issue just have to change here the value here with hdmi hdmi all right hdmi 1 or hdmi 2 depending on what you have i have edp so i'll take edp all right the screen resolution this resolution you copy this copy that all right and PC right here as far as I'm concerned my screen is already I fixed it already on my computer but try this technique and and I sure I can assure you it's gonna work with your on yours so yep when you tap on enter 
that should actually automatically work all right but there's also another option Dep depends on your computer actually if your computer do support uh, all, a 49 inch ultra wide monitor then you don't need to go all through this so the second solution I wanted to show you is to go on your display setting display setting all right go to your display right so as you can see here is my 49 inch Dell monitor and this is my laptop right here are the different resolutions that you can have on uh, a 49 49 inch monitor but the resolution you remember we did work on a 3840 this resolution is not available as an option so what we did was just adding this option so it could fit to your display screen so when this is done all you have to do then to be going back and forth each time you reboot your pretty system it may not go directly on uh, ultra wide mode so what you're gonna do is add a new mode a new profile from here when you go to advance add a new profile then type a profile name. All right, I'm gonna write uh, Ica Codec. All right. Then enter, because this this gonna what you're gonna do? You're gonna save your actual profile. Then to be re re like retyping all the code we've been doing ever since you started the video. You, all you have to do is come to your profile, select the profile, and apply the profile. All right. When you apply it you say keep the keep this configuration say yes all right like that you don't have to type all of the codes we did at the beginning of the video but as well if as i said your laptop supports 49 inch monitor you don't need to go all through this all right so hopefully you enjoy the video as far as you may ask which operating system i'm using this is the Catalina distribution, the latest version right now. Uh, if you have any any other question, just drop a comment and I will get you back. So uh, we can so we give support for Windows, Linux, or Mac computer. And uh, we're gonna we're gonna start dropping new video tutorial for um for programming. That will be, I think, next month. I know we've been talking about that for a while, but right now we're actually gonna launch it. So get ready for the new for the new other options we're gonna propose to you guys. So love you guys. Stay tuned to our new videos. Please don't don't forget to like, comment, and most important, subscribe. Subscribe, cause I see that most of you guys don't subscribe and like too. Come on, guys, like it. All right. Stay tuned with us. Bye-bye.